This is TomorrowPictures.tv. I didn't breathe. George Floyd. Uh, I'm going to in Washington, and we're going to do something that uh, people have to see before. In the brief span of 30 odd years, the world has seen an inventor's dream. This is no simple reform. Freedom and human dignity. It really is a revolution. You could ask yourself a question. Teach you how to kill. Do I feel lucky? We're like the stupid people. Far more powerful than anything man has yet devised. Inspiration and hope. Life is visceral. Tearing down that wall. Buy a for a man. Because we had stupid politicians doing stupid things. Let's get this straight. The United States. Enough on his life. and boldly. Stupid. Uh, Health care is tough. I don't know about that one, actually. Um, all I know is I keep paying more and more and more. So I, I don't have an answer on that. I don't know if anybody has an answer on that. That one's a tough one. Do you so. have any other concerns you'd like to hear him speak about today? Uh, what else? What else do we want to hear? I don't know. None that I can think of. No? No. Anything else you'd like to share? No, thank you. <laughs> you got well, kids here, too? Say hi. Hello. Hi. You can look for yourselves on tomorrowpictures.tv. And thanks for speaking with us. Right. Take care. Thanks, guys. He represents himself. Like, he... Orange males. Can we go with that? Oompa Loompa rights. Alf. Alf, yeah. Does he eat cats? I don't know. check on that. What do you think about his foreign policy? I think his foreign policy is give it here. That's all he has. He's, he says he's going to make everybody pay for stuff because we have a trade deficit with them. But that's just because we ask for more goods than them. He has no foreign policy. He has no experience. Do you have any special concerns that you'd like to talk about today? Um, no, there's no real sole issue that I feel supported to. I think that if everybody can just be great to one another, just accept everybody for who they are, then the world would be such a better place. All right, global warming, that's something we gotta talk about. Global warming, global, warming, global climate change, whatever the correct term is. It's just, I think it's hysterical that people debate whether it's real or not, because science clearly points to every fact that it is. And then you got Sarah Palin fighting Bill Nye, and you don't fight the science guy. Do you see a lot of uh, pro-Trump supporters on campus? Um, not, not many. I, I do understand that they may not be as vocal or open about it because this is a very pro-Democrat, pro-liberal, pro-Bernie campus. Um, that doesn't mean that they don't exist and they definitely have their right to be here and speak their minds. Um, as an RA, I even sent out an email making sure that anyone who was either attending the rally, attending the protest, or even attending class made sure that they felt safe um, and that their voices were being heard, whether they're for, on this side or the other side. My, my, my idea of Trump being here, I've actually spoken to a, a, a few kind gentlemen and I've even asked them why do you even support Trump to begin with? And it couldn't give me a full list of reasons, right? One man, he only did want it because of the wall, because he wanted to keep Mexicans out. But the Mexicans were harder than anybody else. Another man was talking about because he was supporting Trump and uh, maintaining the uh, standard of living. And I asked that man what it was his definition of standard of living. Uh, he was talking about having what you need but wanting more. That's not what we're here for. We're not talking about having what you need and wanting more. We're not talking about those privileges. I'm talking about not having enough to survive, period. And when they keep... Do you have any other concerns you want to voice today? Um, Regarding the election? Regarding the election? <laughs> um, Are you students no. here? No. no. Uh, From Westchester? No. Great Valley, Valley High School. Valley. Valley. We go to Great Valley. Henderson. Yeah. yeah. Westchester proud. Senior. No. Yeah, he goes to Henderson. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, well, thanks for talking with us. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Do you know where this is going to be? Tomorrowpictures.tv. Oh, my gosh. Oh, you're the best. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Uh, tonight, we'd like to say a uh, special thanks. We don't have much time to thank everybody, and especially to our friends in the business and to our wonderful friends here and all of you out there for your great loyalty. Justice will be served. I would simply like to say that I think this has been one of the great days of America.